I'm Cody Stevenson, I'm the producer and editor for this film. I'm Josiah Jennings, and I am the director of this film. I'm Cassidy, and I'm the writer. I'm Jaren, and I'm the co-writer. Hi, I'm Tanner, I'm the cameraman. I'm Will Graham, I'm the cameraman. I'm Ian Person, and I love parkour. What was your childhood like? My childhood was pretty average. Uh, parents were divorced, but that didn't really factor into it much. Uh, instead of most kids uh, playing on PlayStations, Game Boys, Xboxes, and things like that, uh, I was generally out in the backyard, flipping on swings, climbing trees, climbing buildings, uh, generally doing mischievous things that I really shouldn't be doing. What do I think about Ian? <laughs> guy's freaking crazy, dude. The stuff that he does, ridiculous! I asked him what inspired him, and he said LaFlair. Is that a type of food? Uh, when did you first discover parkour? I first discovered parkour um, when I found out about a guy named LaFlair. He is basically one of the coolest, uh, kindest, and most active individuals in the sport of parkour that I am aware of. Uh, he's based in LA. He does a lot of professional filming, a lot of uh, a little bit of stunt performing for actual uh, Hollywood productions. Can you tell us what the basic parkour really is? Um, well, basically parkour originated in France. Uh, it was designed to get from point A to point B in the quickest and most efficient style possible, rather than taking crowded streets or walkways that weren't 100% or detours of any of that nature. You could kind of just go up and over objects, go through objects, basically just take a straight line to wherever you're going. And that's kind of evolved into American free running and parkour. Uh, free running is a little bit different because free running is a lot about tricks. Uh, the flips, the side flips, the back flips, all the kind of fancy stuff. Now the three main elements to doing a no stand long jump is number one, your run back. It has to be far enough, but not too far. If you go too far, then you're gonna lose a lot of power on your jump. Uh, it's going to take a lot of your forward momentum and kind of almost reverse it. Second element is your actual takeoff. And you wanna be able to do this from one foot and try to aim where you're gonna land, pick up both feet, and that turns into the third element, which is aiming where your feet are going and sticking them both out and hitting precisely where you wanted to go. How do you feel when you do parkour? Um, I feel really free. I guess that's the only word for it. The best way to describe it is when you get up somewhere really, really high, when you get past the fear of, oh my god, I'm going to fall, and you just kind of look out and you realize you're getting to see something that not many other people get to see really ever, uh, kind of gives you a different perspective on a lot of things. You know everybody dies someday, but not many people really get to live. <laughs>